over here, um, there's a, um, there's a guy doing a stall off of a, um, apartment building thing, and the guy that's just, um, doing, like, I um, don't know the name of the trick, but it's the thing where you, like, put the board behind your head and you're, like, doing front flips. It's really, really difficult to do in real life, almost impossible. But, um, there you go. Here's a guy that's half demon, up in the corner, I did that. But you see the guy's, like, turning into a demon on one side. The other side, he's pretty much normal, except for the little marks on his hand. He has this big demon arm and stuff. I also drew this at the beginning of the year, so... Yeah. I'm getting better and better in some of these things. I tried drawing a bunch of different eye types. Didn't turn out very well. No, it didn't. And then, um, school stuff right here. Here's the guy. I like his hair a lot, the way that I got that. And, um, his eyes look pretty nice. And this skull is like my trademark skull. It has a, um, a crack going through the eye, and then he's breathing, and um, black flames out. I started drawing that a few months ago. And he's pretty good at that thing. Bald guy, right here, bald. Another person that I started when I finished. There's a New York skater. He has New York on his jacket. Um, here's his head. Looks pretty cool. He looks like he's only about 12 or 13. He looks kind of young. I don't know how I made him look that young, but then he has his New York board. Looks really basic for New York, but it's behind his arm, so you can't see all of it. And his coat sort of looks like a military coat with some of the things on it, but military New York, you know. There's his um, pants, shoes, in the background like I did before, a guy doing a stall. There's people um, racing down a um, a parking thing, if you can see that. Some of them are like ollieing over cars to get down faster. It took me a while to do that. And up here it's the guy saying King of the Hill. K-O-T-H. But you can't really see that, just... Because it's not that high quality of the video. Here's, here's a guy with a really bad wipeout. And the guy that's about to land on him. I thought that was kind of funny what I do. Here's a few people. As you can see, just a few people. And then, um, I don't know if there's a few people in there. I drew these little weird elf things a few weeks ago. And this one that's hiding. Not very good at all, really. I don't like it very much, but, oh well, whatever interests you. Alright, uh, now I'm going to have to break this into two videos, because I see that it's going over 12 minutes. Sorry about that. But, um, this is really good. And here's a guy with, like, decked in, um, decked in leather, I guess is what they call it. And they have, um, they have two pretty cool swords on his back. But one of them is only strapped down, one of them has a, sh a sheath. And he's wearing black pants. He has different um, weapons in here. He looks really cool. He also has the inverse size. He said you were more recently, so it looks a lot better. Here's a, um, there's a guy who's a cyborg, except it's, um, it's like covered with skulls and stuff to make it not look like it. But I never finished him, and when I do, I'm going to draw one that's not covered, and you can see everything, how how creepy he is, how creepy and weird he looks, but really kind of low quality right now, I've never got to finish him. And then, and then what I did a few weeks ago is I made an anime people from Nintendo, and um, there's Mario, should be able to tell, and on Nintendo it says Mario, it has his gloves on, his overalls, I don't really ever color my drawings, so in case you were wondering, it's just feet, and so. Kirby, he looks, eh, okay. Yeah, Kirby. A lot of bubble gum, carrots for feet, smiling all the time. Should be stepped on and, like, stuck to somebody's shoe. Nasty, he's holding a little bear, I don't know why I drew that. But it's like wind's blowing on the grass and his hair. His hat's about to fall off. It's his nest in the bottom. And it just looks pretty cool. Everything. There's, um, it looks really, really good in my, um, Diddy Kong. Not sure, yeah, I wrote Diddy Kong down there. And there he is, he's swinging from a branch. 
or a, um, a vine actually. And here is Donkey Kong in my style. Has an underbite, pretty nice, in my opinion. Um, I guess muscles or chesticles, man boobs, you know, maybe. He's hairy also, because well, he's Donkey Kong. He's supposed to be hairy. Captain Falcon, I never quite finished at all. Here's a really cool one of Shy Guy. Just threw that yesterday also. And he has a pretty nice one of um, Toad. He has like a hat on instead of a... Um, instead of this one. Here's one of Pit, in case you don't realize. I should probably add a Halo to that. Just do things with that Halo a lot of the time. Pit says up in the corner. And here's the king of Nintendo, in my opinion, out of the best games, Link. He has a shield in the back, his sword, master sword. Um, he has his hair, pretty nice. I swear that I drew that better than the Twilight Princess one, in my opinion. I don't really like his hair being all that long and crappy. It adds to him having a skirt or a kilt, they call it, and it makes him look a lot like a girl. But, um, he's also, he's wearing his tunic, has, like, the collar on. Down here, you can see his um, gauntlets with the um, triforces on them. His kilt, man skirt thing. Oh, and up here is his thing filled with weapons. His um, don't know what you'd call that. I'll figure it out later though. Here's his um, boots. Also have the um, triforce on them, triforce symbol, and his um, and that stuff is gonna remain white. Because that's sort of like the color of the stuff that is, um, that is like his, um, other stuff. And here's Link without his tunic. And his wooden sword from the beginning of Twilight Princess, for those of you who don't know. It came out pretty okay, but nothing too major. Uh, Territory Wars. Um, all of these are in my other journal. Here's the mailbox head for, um, bag heads, which I draw. I'll be uploading a few videos about them later on, a lot later on though. Uh, here's just a big clock tower. Pretty random. Really random actually. Stormy in the background. Like I said, Stitch the Ragdoll. And that's a really bloody thing that one. Oh wait a second, I have stuff that I used in here that's like my other section. And I was going to make an entire